I've been thinking, God must be a very sad person, you know? Because he knows every sad story there is. But then at the same time, shouldn't he be a really happy person? Because he knows every happy story there is. But I guess there's more sad stories than there are happy ones out there. So I don't know. Go away. <laughs> come in and wave. You can come in and wave if you want. But it's my brother. I don't know what he's doing. So, you know, I think about these things. And it kind of bothers me. I wouldn't want to be God. Well, at the same time, I kind of would. No, I wouldn't. No, because it'd be terrible. All that power and so many decisions to make. But I guess he kind of knows what he's doing, so... He's the ruler, right? I got my goals back from the university experience class. And, uh... It's funny, because when I read them, like, I'm looking at them right now, and it says short-term goals. Where do you want to be in six months? And it says... I want to have completed my first semester in college without mishap. Spiritually, I want to be more mature. Um, looks like that turned out okay. I don't know if I'm more mature, but I passed on my classes like I wanted to. I kept my scholarship. I enjoyed everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm more involved. Maybe. See, girl! <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm looking at this. No. No. <laughs> what? That's kind of nice. What? There's nothing to look at. <laughs> what? We're going to watch 24. <laughs> anyway, goodbye. I think it's funny, like, whenever I look at my short-term, like, it says professionally, and it says I want to be looking at short-term opportunities and things that are going to, like, enhance my understanding experience. I think that kind of happened. Um, when it comes to finishing what I'm writing, I'm not quite done, but I finished the first part, and I've got it dedicated and everything. And I know where I'm headed, sort of, in my major. It's news and editorial journalism. So, I mean, it shouldn't be that bad. I like it a lot so far. And then when I look at my other goals, that I want to be closer to God and my family, and my spiritual family, and my friends, I think I've done that. And then the last thing says, maybe by now I will have had a few close relationships. And I've learned from them. <laughs> and that's definitely happened. So, I don't know, I want to go watch 24, and I'm really cold, and I'm tired, and Western made it to the NCAA, both teams. I've been waiting for this for like four years now. I'm so excited. Maybe I'll get to go to one of the tournament games. Oh, I hope I do. I hope I do. And if, we, if I go, I hope it doesn't ruin the whole space-time continuum. <sighs> I'm so excited. Okay. Sweet charity. Sweet charity. Probably the most depressing play, musical, you can go to. It's great. Like the song, Do You Wanna Have Fun? That's like the most awesome song ever. And then it's got some really good lines in it, like, Have you ever had a day that's just, that was just perfect? Or something like that. It's awesome. But it's too realistic, because at the end, after she gets the guy, he's like, I can't be with you. 
I'm sorry. I'm saving you by not being with you. I mean, what? What kind of ending is that? And we're all just sitting there. Me and Nikki are sitting there like, oh, no. Surely they're not going to end it like this after two hours of sitting through this thing, waiting for something good to happen. It happens. And then what happens? It gets taken away. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Oh, yeah. Spring break. Starts out with snow. <laughs> Who knows anymore? You know, life is so unpredictable. But it's great. Oh! A Tale of Two Sisters. I've got the Asian version here, but it's A Tale of Two Sisters, and it's amazing. Make sure you look at it closely. It's so, so weird. It's not exactly gruesome, except for in a few parts. It's not like gruesome the whole time, it's just like you're waiting on the edge for it to be gruesome kind of thing. And across the universe. I got this on DVD the day it came out. Ooh, that's weird. See how everything started glowing when I put it up? But, oh. Oh. Yes. Are we ready to watch it? Yeah, that is. Okay, I'm coming. Okay. <laughs> but anyway. Best movie ever. And I still haven't watched it on DVD, because I want to be in a good mood when I do. Because I don't want to ruin it. Because the last time I saw it, it was amazing, and I don't really think I can top the last time I saw it. So, even though I got it the day it came out on DVD, I still haven't watched it since it was in the theater. But I listen to the soundtrack all the time. So that's cool. And August Rush came out on DVD today, so I want to get that. Oh yeah, and I went tanning today for the first time in forever. I haven't been regularly tanning since like November, which was probably the best month of my life. And oh my goodness, last year was totally the best year of my life. So yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go. So just remember, the Lord giveth and the Lord takes away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. <laughs> or on a happier note, um, sit on it!